Hello students. Today we will learn chapter number 2 input and output devices. Let's revise the identify hardware and a software. So write a h for hardware and write s for a software below each pictures. And in a previous chapter you learned about computer and its devices. And now let's us recall them and learn more about them. So these are the answer where mouse is a hardware device and a text paint a window and a windows 10 is a software device whether a printer or a, a monitor is a hardware devices Now next is uh, things will be explored in this chapter input devices output devices and their uses or if you wanted to go with the uh, videos of this chapter so just click on that link So these are the com uh, computer input devices and uh, output devices. Now, first let's learn about uh, input devices. So these devices that help us to enter the data into the computer and give orders and call input devices called input devices. And these are used to input the user's data and instruction or information into computer. Some common input devices are scanner barcode reader mouse joystick touch screen microphones and keyboards and web cameras so these are the input devices and let's learn more about it some common input devices which is keyboard so keyboard is a most common and a very popular input devices which help us to input data into the computer or a keyboard is used to give input to the data by typing numbers letter and a special characters now next we move on to mouse so a mouse is used to send instru instructions to the computer with the click of a button and it is also used to draw a picture and a select object in the computer it is called a pointing devices next is a scanner a scanner is used to read paper documents images or a pictures and send them to input into the computer joysticks a joystick is used to play a game on a computer and it also helps to control the different movement in the game our next topic is a microphones a microphone is an input device and it is used to record voice music and a sound and then it can be stored on a computer Now let's uh, latest input devices is a barcode reader a barcode reader or a barcode scanner is a device used to capture and read information contained in a barcode next is a fingerprint scanner reader is used to for a recognize or identify the fingerprint or to authentication the identification of a individual next is a latest input devices So magnetic ink character recognition which is called MICR is used to verify the original paper documents especially checks which have special ink optical whether optical mark reader OMR is used to read questionnaires multiple choice examination paper from the line or a shaded areas Let's learn output devices The devices that shows us the result of a processing done by the CPU are called output devices and these are hardware equipments which convert information into a human readable form called output devices and the output devices uh, which is display on the screen of a monitor is called a soft copy where a point out or uh, for the some soft copy on a paper is called a hard copy of the output so there are the some example of our output devices which is flash drives smart boards projector plotter printer headphones monitor and a speakers now next is a input element or a output elements so the hardware we use to give instruction information we give to the computer through a devices are input devices uh, like in a in a simple word we can say for those which we can uh, instruct to the computer with the help of uh, different different kinds of devices we call a input devices and the hardware we use to uh, get audio visual or information from a computer through a devices are output devices 
with the help of uh, output devices we uh, get information from the computer so here are some output devices first is a monitor a monitor look like a television this is monitor and it is also run as a visual display unit or a video and the monitor shows the data that you input and its result output after the computer process it now next is a printer and this is our printer and a printer is used to print the result of the work done by the user computer on a paper and we can print documents drawing images etc in a black and white and as well as in a color using a printer and there are uh, two types of printer which is laser printer and a inject printer it is a laser printer used for a laser beam to print the hard copy uh, with a inject printer it sprays ink on a paper to print the hard copy next is a speaker speaker is these are this is a speaker and speaker are used to hear a music voice and sound on a computer now next is a headphones headphones are used to listen the music and sound without disturbing others as they as worn by an individual but wearing them for a long time can affect your hearing power and cause damage to your ears now last is a projector this is projector and a projector or a projects or display data to of a computer screen on a large screen or a surface for a audience now there here are types of a printer which is, this is called a laser printer and it is used for a laser beam to the printer and this is a inject printer inject printer is spray the ink on the paper to print the hard copy now next is a some latest output devices this is a smart board a smart board is a large interactive display board in the form work factor of a white boards whether uh, next is a gps gps is a global positioning system helps you to get where you are going from a point a to point b or you want for a uh, find a location now let's explore from some book activity on page number 90 and write the name of a following devices so this is the this is called a printer inject printer and it is a speakers headphones and a webcam see printer speakers headphones and a webcam now next move on to storage devices storage devices a storage device is a piece of a computer hardware used for a saving carrying and a pulling out data uh, same as if you wanted to store your food so you uh, need uh, for a container so same as it is uh, if your computer uh, wants to save any data or any information so there is a, a storage devices which is called also called a memory and it's used for a saving our documents and carrying the pulling out the data for a future use and it can keep the retain information short term or a long term so these are the some storage devices flash drive floppy drive a uh, disk type tape media sd card cd dvd pen drives and a memory card so here are some uh, storage devices this is called a cd or a dvd and pen drives storage e devices and a sd cards now our chapter is finished uh, thank you so much